One of Spain's most iconic paintings, Pablo Picasso's Guernica, is undergoing a high-tech health check. Every night, a robot nicknamed Pablito uses advanced infrared and ultraviolet photographic technology to take tens of thousands of tiny shots of the painting. Analysts can see scratches undetectable by the human eye. We've never done it in such an ambitious way. What we usually do is take a general shot of a painting, but never such small macro photographs scanning an entire painting, sewing them together and generating a mega image. Spain's Republican government commissioned the work after the bombing of Basque town Guernica in 1937 to capture on canvas the horrors of war. Guernica then spent two decades on the road. Well, this work has had a very complicated life. I think of works of this format, it's probably experienced the roughest beginnings because of its nature and what it represented for the artist and history at the same time. In 1981, Guernica was returned to Spain and has been housed in the Reina Sofia Museum in Madrid ever since but some believe it should be exhibited in the Basque country. Very generic technical difficulties are always used as an excuse not to move the painting, but there have been previous relocations of paintings as important and difficult as this one, and nowadays this obstacle is perfectly surmountable. What happens is we have the feeling the Reina Sofia Museum has kidnapped the painting. In Bilbao and elsewhere, the painting still has the power to provoke strong emotions.